Hi everyone, welcome to the MDM Minute with Peter Shank. Today, I want to start an inspiration series using sacred geometry and water. And if you are a graduate of the ascending the rabbit holes, you kind of know what you're in for. So, you know, everyday life in the Western countries is filled with stress, you know, need to make more money, I'm worried about everything. You know, you feel guilty about certain things. And, 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 and this series is really geared towards just eliminating everything and inspiring you to be the best person you can be every day. So honestly, I don't know how long the series is going to go on for. It really takes a lot of work every day to make an MDM minute, whether it's just, you know, out in nature teaching you a trick or, you know, utilizing two or three different cameras to capture certain articles and then bring it all together within, you know, an MDM minute. So for this, you're just going to need a piece of paper, a pen or a pencil, and of course, a glass of water. Everything I do is with water. And we're going to be utilizing some sacred geometry, some really simple but yet powerful stuff to aspire you to greatness. You know, the way we live today is not the way we were meant to live. We are so conditioned. We are bombarded day in, day out, 24-7, nonstop with negativity all the time. You know, it's, it's getting up in the morning. It, it, sometimes it's a challenge. You know, if you have kids, work, school, stress, it all just boils down. And over time, it really wreaks havoc on the body, mind, and spirit. You know, stress. I, I had a lot of stress. I worked on Wall Street for 20 years and in technology for one of the world's largest investment banks. And I know all about stress. And the body is an amazing machine. It will attune itself to stress over time. And then, you know, the body will start to break down. And if you become conscious about it, you can really curb it. But if you're not, you know, a lot of bad things can happen to you. So again, this is just about inspiring you. We're gonna be using geometry to motivate you to bring the best out even under the harshest conditions i want to bring the best out in you okay this is motivation i am not and i don't pretend to be a motivational speaker that's tony robinson's job and and, and others out there i just know what i know and i know what inspires me sacred geometry is absolutely amazing so with that said you'll need a piece of paper and a pen and draw what's below so we're going to start out with a diamond folks This first part is really to energize us, okay? It's gonna help create the foundation for everything that's gonna follow. It's a basis. And you can you can do this technique as many times a day as you want. You can use a gallon of water to do that, to do this. Okay, it's all about motivating yourself. You know, some people, I've, I've gotten emails over the years from people saying, you know, the, the, the geometry you create is very potent, but yet it's simple. Yeah, that's right, folks. Simplicity is the way through everything. Nothing in life needs to be complicated. As humans, we overcomplicate everything. Day in and day out, we're constantly overcomplicating ourselves. Why does sacred geometry have to be you know, the star tetrahedron, some three-dimensional moving something or other. You know, people talk about higher dimensions. Well, I'm a being of the third dimension, and I draw in two dimensions, and I know what works. So <laughs> just follow along. Just, you know, you don't have to be Picasso or Leonardo da Vinci. Just draw what you see. There is no right way. There is no wrong way. There's only the perfect way. But you need to draw it in the order that I am. This this part is really important. And of course, this is on YouTube, so you can go back and watch it as many times as you want. <laughs> kind of sound like Mr. Rogers. <laughs> go figure that out. Okay, a couple more pieces here, and we are done. Again, this is all about just inspiring you to be the best you can be today. And I'm going to be doing many more videos along these lines over the next few days to help you get in the flow.
Okay. So what I want everyone to do is just breathe through your mouth, not your nose, through your mouth. And exhale through your nose. Okay, you can close your eyes and sit back when you're doing it. And what's happening is when you're breathing in, okay, with your attention on the geometry, you're breathing in the power of that geometry. And when you're exhaling, you're pushing the junk out, okay? This is to motivate you, okay? This is to the baseline for everything that's going to follow. Get this down. Each video that I put out every day to motivate you is going to be exceptional, okay? We'll cover a different topic every day. This is the baseline. This is energy. This is creating the foundation to get you up, get you motivated, whatever you have to do. I'm going to be teaching you stress techniques, how to cope with it, how to make it dissipate. You know, you get bombarded with, with, with things unexpected every day, and sometimes they, they feel like a razor. They're cutting into you. You, know, you get this shock. You're like, oh, wow. I'm going to make those razor edges dull, okay? So when they the information does come to you in whatever form it comes in you it's not going to penetrate you're going to be like okay i can handle it i have the equipment i'm ready to do it with your left hand take that glass of water and put it right over the middle of that geometry okay this is where the cool stuff starts happening folks i'd like you to take your hands and i want you to wrap them around the glass with the fingers touching okay but don't touch the glass very very important close your eyes breathe three times through your mouth exhale through your nose Put your attention on the water and repeat the words out loud. I honor the space in which you exist. And you'll just feel that water explode with energy. Geometry is creating the, the temporal programming that we need. The hands wrapped around it are containing it. You might start to feel it running up. And when you're ready, with your left hand only, pick it up and drink as much as you want. That one's good. So, again, do this as many times as you want. This is the baseline for inspiration, to pull you out of that world of negativity and float you into the higher octaves. Okay, very, very important, folks, to float you into the higher octaves. Level one. Thank you.